Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In this video, we are going to take up one engaging exponential equation challenge. It is 7 plus 4 root 3 whole power is x cube minus 7 plus 7 minus 4 root 3 whole power x cube minus 7 equal to 14. We have to find out real solutions only. So let's get started by considering the product between the given bases. See, one base is 7 plus 4 root 3. Another base is 7 minus 4 root 3. Let's check what will come out once I will consider product between the two. So this result I will use. You can say a plus b. If I will consider a as 7, b as 4 root 3, then it is written a plus b times a minus b. So in that place I can write a square minus b square. So let's apply this formula. In place of a it is 7 so 7 square minus 4 root 3 square so this value will become 49 minus 4 square is 16 root 3 square is 3 so 48 so this result will come out unity 1 so let me write here 7 plus 4 root 3 times 7 minus 4 root 3 equal to 1. So if I will divide both sides with 7 plus 4 root 3, then we can cancel these two brackets. So instead of writing 7 minus 4 root 3 here, we can write 1 over 7 plus 4 root 3. And this property is very very effective for our solution point. So let me write 7 minus 4 root 3 equal to 1 over 7 plus 4 root 3. This result we will use in our equation. Let's apply. So this will become 7 plus 4 root 3. Whole power is x cube minus 7 plus. In this place I will write 1 over 7 plus 4 root 3 whole power is x cube minus 7. RHS is 14. Now I will split our power by the property of exponent. We can write 1 over a. Let me write that property. Whole power is suppose n. Then we can write it is 1 over a power n. So here we will be writing 1 plus 4 root 3 whole power is x cube minus 7 plus 1 over 7 plus 4 root 3 whole power is x cube minus 7 and RHS is 14 using this exponent law. Now you can see in numerator denominator it is same exponent with base. So let us use substitution. So I will consider 7 plus 4 root 3 whole power is x cube minus 7 this value equal to suppose t so our equation will become this equation we can write t plus 1 over t equal to 14 and t cannot be 0 so i can multiply this equation with t so equation will become t square plus 1 equal to 14t. Take all the term to LHS. So this quadratic will become t square minus 14t plus 1 equal to 0. This is one quadratic equation. I will use Sridharachar formula or quadratic formula. t square minus 14t plus 1 equal to 0. Let's write that formula first. It is minus b plus minus under the root b square minus 4ac divided by 2a. So if I will apply, I will be writing minus b. So 14 minus of minus 14 plus 14 under the root b square 196 minus 4ac minus 4 divided by 2a, a is 1, 2. So t will be equal to 
फोर्टीन प्लस माइनस स्क्वायर रूट वन नाइनटी टू डिवाइडेड बाई टू नो वी नो दैट वन नाइनटी टू इज सिक्सटी फोर टाइम्स थ्री इफ यू विल मल्टीप्लाई सिक्सटी फोर विथ थ्री यू विल हैव वन नाइनटी टू सो सिक्सटी फोर इफ आई विल टेक स्क्वायर रूट देन एट सो लेट मी राइट फोर्टीन प्लस माइनस एट रूट थ्री डिवाइडेड बाई टू सो आई कैन राइट सेवन प्लस माइनस फोर रूट थ्री सो दिस इज टी टी वॉज लेट मी राइट हेयर वट वॉज टी टी वॉज सेवन प्लस फोर रूट थ्री होल पार वॉज एक्स क्यू माइनस थ्री माइनस सेवन इट इज इक्वल टू सेवन प्लस फोर रूट थ्री एंड नेक्स्ट टाइम वी कैन राइट सेवन माइनस फोर रूट थ्री सो लेट मी राइट हेयर इक्वेशन सेपरेटली सो दिस विल बिकम सेवन प्लस फोर रूट थ्री होल पार इज एक्स क्यूब माइनस सेवन इक्वल टू सेवन प्लस फोर रूट थ्री एंड देन वी विल कंसिडर दिस सेवन माइनस फोर रूट थ्री ओके सो बेस इज सेम वी कैन कंसिडर इट इज विथ पावर वन सो आई कैन सिंपली कंपेयर द एक्सपोनेंट्स वन बेस इज आर आइडेंटिकल सेम एक्स क्यूब माइनस सेवन इक्वल टू वन एड सेवन टू बोथ साइड्स एक्स क्यूब इक्वल टू एट एट कैन बी रिटर्न एज इट इज टू क्यूब एक्सपोनेंट इज सेम सो बेस मस्ट बी इक्वल टू इच अदर सो फ्रॉम हेयर वी कैन राइट एक्स इज इक्वल टू टू दिस इज वन क्यूबिक इक्वेशन सो वी विल हैव थ्री सोल्यूशन द अदर रिमेनिंग टू सोल्यूशन विल बी complex value if you want to see you can check like this x cube minus 8 equal to 0 x cube minus 2 cube equal to 0 a cube minus b cube a minus b a square plus b square plus ab so the real solution which will be x equal to 2 is from here so x equal to 2 and from this one the quadratic equation will have complex solution you can just check delta discriminant b square is 2 square minus 4 times 1 times c c is 4 so 4 minus 16 this is negative so complex solution will come but our constraint is real solution it is x equal to 2 now come to the second value second equation that was our t will be equal to t was 7 plus 4 root 3 power was x cube minus 7 and this time i will equate with 7 minus 4 root 3 now you can see i will use that property and i will write right hand side as 1 over 7 plus 4 root 3 in next step i will consider this exponent negative in the numerator so i can write 7 plus 4 root 3 whole power is minus 1 now bases are identical same so exponent must be same so i will write x cube minus 7 this will be equal to negative 1 let's solve add 7 to both sides i will write x cube equal to 7 minus 1 so 6 after considering cube root both sides i can write x is equal to cube root of 6 so this is the only real solution from this cubic equation the remaining two you can prove like this you will be having complex valued solution so overall i can write the real solutions are x is equal to 2 and cube root of 6 i hope you like this video thank you so much for watching do not forget to like share subscribe bye bye till next video good luck and take care